<clears throat> okay, everybody keeps asking me this, so I'm gonna show you guys how to properly cut boro sheet. So here's a scrap of a uh, 3mm boro. This was cut off of one of the plates I got from Lulzbot, but this is typical boro silicate. The idea behind cutting boro silicate is to use some kind of straight edge. I'm even just using a, a printed part here. And you need some kind of glass scoring. Uh, utility. Right now I'm going to use a tungsten carbide router bit for one of my CNC machines. But any glass scoring tool or actually any little piece of tungsten carbide or diamond tip, dremel tip tool is is equally good. So basically get your straight edge set up where you want to cut and do a nice heavy score across there. So you should see that nice heavy score. Now what you really need to do is lick your finger or spit on your finger and get that wet or you can use three in one oil which is even better if you're doing a lot of it but for this small quantity this is fine and then you need something to prop it up with it's gonna, oh this plastic piece won't work but I would take a uh, say this screwdriver and then you're just gonna apply some pressure and it's gonna break perfectly on your cut and see how little pressure I applied and how easy that was and how clean the clean the cuts are and then you know you can grind this down if you want with some uh, dermal tool uh, those little buffers or grinders or whatever if you like uh, or put some tape around the edges or something if you don't want to cut yourself but that's how easy it is to cut borosilicate plates to size um, if you're going to be doing a lot of it or bigger sections, I would recommend using 3-in-1 oil instead of spittle. <laughs> but, you know, in a pinch, spit works fine. I've been doing this for 20 years on Boro to, to make perfect cuts. So, there it is. Cut your Boro to your heart's content.